good evening, good afternoon. Stupid boy. I'm back. Back again. Now then. Now then. 198 subscribers. Two more for 200. Please. Thank you very much. Got a different one. Something different for me again, I think, today. <clears throat> this is going to be a, <clears throat> a big bottle. And it still keeps coming. And it still keeps coming. And it still keeps... It's massive! Well, 750 mil. So, bought it from Aldi. Had it ages. So I thought, oh, let's get it done today. St. Pierre. Oh, yes. It's very nice. Oh, it's Belgium, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, Belgian Abbey beer. A blonde beer. Enriched with spices. Oh, hell. Yeah. Ginger spice, is it? Or sporty? I don't know. 6.2%. It's a huge bottle. Um, and it is actually brewed for Aldi in Belgium. Brewed and bottled in Belgium by Palm NVSA. Uh, uh, Stephen Hufflepuff. That sounds like a name, doesn't it? Uh, Stephen Huffle or Steen Huffle, Belgium. There you go. We were in New Zealand last week. We're in Belgium this week. Can't be bad. I don't need me. Uh, this is going to go all over. I don't need me bottle opener because it's got one of these newfangled things on the front. This is going to go all over, isn't it? <clears throat> ah, let's see how we go. I've got a little glass as well this time. <laughs> right, here we go. Here we go. Hey! <laughs> I got that frightened me, that did. <laughs> all right, there we go. <laughs> Steam. Oh, that smells. Um, that smells interesting. Oh, a blonde beer from Belgium. They usually make them pretty strong. So, um, we'll see where we're at with this one, shall we? Oh, oh, oh it's too heavy to lift. Oh, God, dear. Right. Let's have a look at this. Lovely. Right, it's a lovely, lovely sort of amber golden colour, as you would expect with a blonde beer. Lovely. Um, almost two finger head light and fluffy carbonating well it looks really nice and clean actually that does that looks that looks very nice indeed let's just move that over there a bit right smell wise it doesn't smell much in the way of spices although there is perhaps a hint of something there and i can't quite just put my finger on it Mm. But it smells like a beer. It's a good thing. Right. St. Pierre from Belgium. Hercule Barrow and all that lot. Ah, yes. Um. Mm. Not, not much of a smell there, really. Let's taste it. Let's give it a taste. Cheers, everybody. Don't forget to subscribe to Andy Does Ales. Shh. Don't tell him I said. Hmm, that's got quite a malty taste. If it, if I shall venture forth to say that it's got quite a dark taste, despite the fact that it's not dark. It's got a very malty taste. Very sort of, it's not bright, it's not, mm, you know, it's not fresh, it's not citrusy. It's kind of warm and wintry, if you like this one. I'd almost go to the fact to say that it was musty. It smell, it, it tastes a little musty. Hmm. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. It's it's it is. It's kind of warming. There's there's nothing. It's nice and easy on the tongue. It's nice and easy in the mouth, and it just. Hmm. Not much of a back taste coming back yet. There's no bitterness to it though. It's smooth and it's mellow. That's the word. It's mellow. Yeah. You can just lay back and, hey man, I'm drinking beer. In fact, I'm drinking St. Pierre. <laughs> yeah, there we go. It's not bad. I wouldn't rave about it. 
It looks nice. Mm. It's kind of on the verge of, of, of Trappist. You know, it's the it's not quite strong enough to be Trappist, I don't think. At six point two percent, it's probably just about average for, for what it is. But it's it's and you can taste the alcohol in it. Yeah. It's a it's a half decent pint for two quid or whatever it was, two forty nine or something, for a big seven hundred and fifty mil bottle. Can't grumble. Mass and grumble, but sometimes I still do. Yes, yeah. So, on that one, Brood for Aldi, Saint Pierre, Saint Pierre Blonde Abbey Brew, a Belgian Abbey beer, six point two percent, enriched with spices. Now those spices are not really much forthcoming in the mix, but you know, you never know. They might just appear halfway through the bottle. Mm. It's a tasty beer. It's all right. Wouldn't rave about it. Maybe get it again at some point. But it's okay. It's okay. I hope you enjoy it. If you try it. If you do try it, let me know and see what you think. <sighs> right. After me two days off, back to work tomorrow. And uh, I'll see you next week with another one of these. So keep drinking the beer, folks. Don't forget to subscribe if you can. Please, if you'd like to, that'd be lovely. We might have um, something to say. <coughs> well, nothing like that. No. <coughs> when we reach 200. Who knows? Take care, folks. It's a bit icy out there today, so uh, just be careful. I shall go and watch a bit of Henry Cole for a few minutes. He's digging around an old bike shop, and I find old bike shops interesting. So, on that note... Keep your rubber side down and I will see you next week. Take care folks. Bye bye.